it is the end of the day. I actually made it all the way through my day at work. I'm very proud. I've just got this ridiculous cough that won't go away. I have drank so much tea today. It's ridiculous. But I did finish Unbreakable by Sarah Ella. I am going to do a review for it when I get home. I didn't like it as much as I liked the rest of the series. I felt like it was a little bit too chaotic that I couldn't really attach myself to any one character or their line of thought. They all started to jumble together in a way I wasn't really enjoying. But it had a very Sarah Ella feel. You had the references thrown in there and the magical elements, which I always have loved about the series. But that means I have now officially gone off of my Reading Rush TBR and I have started reading Touched by I think Claire North is her name. That is for one of my book clubs. I need to finish it for Monday. And then <clears throat> I also need to read about 75 pages in this beautiful book. But you guys probably don't even care about this. This is for work. So that's probably going to happen tonight. I also have another book club thing tonight, which I haven't read anything for. So I'm going to read those pages for that. So those two things aren't going to count on my reading rush stuff, but it is a thing I'm reading. So I figured I should tell you about it. I don't know. But my goal for the rest of the week is to finish Touched. Maybe if I have time after I finish Touched, I'll throw something in there. I'm kind of itching to read Ancient Mang Mangus Bride. I can't say that with this frog in my throat right now. Ancient Mangus Bride. I want to dive into that series really bad. I just kind of want to like binge through all of that. But the rest of this week is going to be crazy. I've got a wedding tomorrow. I've got a family event, baseball game, concert on Saturday. And then I've got... um a whole bunch of live shows on Sunday. My standard coloring live show. Hopefully my voice isn't too ridiculous at that point. And then of course the Tell It Again book club live show with Shay, who was amazing. And I'm really looking forward to it because I really did like the read this time around. Spoilers, even though you're probably going to be seeing this after that live show anyway, so it doesn't matter. But I am going to stop babbling now and get on with what I was doing. You're welcome. So I'm just about to record my video and I figured why don't I just step you through my setup because it has definitely changed a lot since I began booktube and the last time I showed what my setup was. Oh, excuse me. I'm, I'm st it, I feel like I'm talking in my head right now. But as you can see, I have the pseudo me set up right now. Don't I look adorable? And then of course, if we were to sit and look at what I'm looking at when I film. We've got my camera, we've got the Yeti mic set up, we've got this light box, and then over there we have another light box that is bouncing off the ceiling. I need to turn it a little bit, I haven't done that yet. And then you can see on the monitor, you can't really see it very much right now because it's so blown out. You can see us on the monitor, wave. And then of course you've got my whole desk set up so that when I'm live streaming, I can switch over to the webcam and the drawing and all of that kind of stuff. But yeah, you can see little Teddy up there, but I am going to go switch that light box so it's pointed more towards where it needs to be, and then I'm gonna film. It's Friday, which means it's the last day of work. Yay! Uh, yeah, so I got work, and then I've got a wedding, so I'm gonna be leaving work a little bit early. I'm still untouched. I didn't read much of anything last night except for my book that I needed to read for my group. Did not read Crossing the Chasm at all. I'll probably try and sneak that in at work today. That's pretty much all I got. I mean, work, wedding, try to read. Hopefully it works. I got a little distracted last night by doing... Mm -hmm doing all those videos. I'm trying not to cough in your faces right now. I apologize. I am surprisingly feeling better though my throat is like completely raw, which is fun. I'm probably going to lose my voice at some point, but eh, what can you do? Okay, I suppose I should do the work thing. 
the end of the work day. I finished reading Crossing the Chasm. Well, I didn't finish reading it. I finished reading the section that I was supposed to read of Crossing the Chasm. It was the first part of it. I think it's going to be fairly interesting. It didn't quite go into the detail that I wanted to yet, but that's for a different read. Um, I did pick up volume two of Ancient Mangus Bride. I just needed a switch of everything and that fit quite nicely into my breaks. So I read that and then I read like two pages of Touched. No, Touch. <laughs> I keep on wanting to calling it Touched, but Touch. I read two pages. I'm gonna probably have to binge it somehow this evening and tomorrow and get it done because I highly doubt I'll be able to have time on Sunday to read it. But who knows? But otherwise, I'm going to go and pick up my husband, and we're going to go to a wedding, and food. I like food. I like food a lot. I am going to interrupt this vlog to show you this beautiful phone case. Is it not the prettiest thing you have ever seen? I'm so excited. It is a Kirby Rosan uh, collaboration with Rhino... What? Rhino Shield? I had to get it. It's cute. And it is a seahorse, which I am technically a dragon. And if you've ever seen fruit basket, fruits baskets, you will understand the seahorse. You will totally get the seahorse. So this is going to be my new phone case. I'm super excited. Ah! So I completely failed at vlogging at all today. Completely. I was halfway through the baseball game, and I'm like, I haven't actually updated you on Diddly Squat. So at this point, I am about 130 pages away from finishing Touched. It's pretty much all I read today, which is, what, 300 pages I read in a book? And it's slowly getting darker. Isn't that fun? Um, but mostly, I spent today at a baseball game, hanging out with family, and then a concert. And now we're on our way home, and I'm going to attempt to read more probably pass out but i am gonna attempt to read more and then hi okay bye it is the next day it is the final day of the reading rush i almost couldn't remember what to call it it almost became booktubeathon again i am getting ready to start my live stream we'll see how long i last before i start coughing i've been doing pretty good I can probably go about 30 minutes before I have to do a major cough, so that's kind of what I'm hoping for right now. As you can see, here, all kinds of set up and, and ready to go. I don't know if you can see all of that. Yeah, we've got the, the webcam, we've got, we've got the light, we've got the other light, we've got the art cart, and then of course, you know, all the computer junk and of course the yeti just hanging out over there i don't have it set up properly i just realized that but that's beside the point so i am going to do this live stream i am going to eat food and read a little bit i've only got a hundred pages left of touch which is awesome i can get that done today and then I'm going to have a live show with Shay in which we talk about the last of her name. And it's going to be really, really fun and really, really exciting. And I can't wait. So I'll give you little mini updates throughout the day. Hopefully I'll actually remember. And then, of course, I will edit and upload this probably uh, whenever you see it. So that's a thing. Oh, thank you. So I just got done with doing a, a live stream with Shay. And look, you can see my husband in the background. Just hanging out <laughs> as he slinks down and the, there, there's my camera and Shay used to be on that screen and we used to be on that screen and there were things and we said words about books and you look terrified dog terrified but I am happy to say that I did finally finish touch I finished it that's an accomplishment I got that group tomorrow and this is the end of Readorama so I've officially accomplished seven books for Readorama and then all of the challenges and now all I want to do is nap and forget that the world exists for a long period of time because yes so I'm probably gonna do that I hope you guys have all had just as much fun doing Readorama as I have 
read rama It's not read rama Have I said read rama like 13 times now? I've probably said read Oh my gosh, the reading rush. I think it's because I did the read rama announcement the other day. Now I just got read rama stuck in my head. Oh my gosh. Okay, so reading rush is done. I've accomplished seven books, all the challenges. I'm repeating myself, and so I am going to go, and I heart you beautiful faces. And I guess I'll see you again at some point, because that's what I do. Goodbye. Okay,